Greetings friends, Ken McCallop, the jazz vinyl audiophile, back again on a Saturday here at the luxurious and opulent headquarters of the Jazz Record Center. Hope you come visit sometime. Today's question is simple. How many records are too many records? Have you thought about that, friend? Have you walked into your apartment and seen rows and rows of records, but you can't find the screwdriver? Have you walked in and had to push tons of records out of, way, out of the way to find your cat? who is sleeping under records, maybe for months at a time? Have you walked in your apartment and not been able to find the light switch to turn on to see what is the plain fact that you have too many records? Think about that, friend. I ask you to think about that. But really, um, how many records are too many records? I know I have too many records. I have a big rack full of records, three actually, the Calyx that I bought and put records in. Then I have two other record racks full of records. Then I have a bookcase full of records. And on the floor, in two different rooms, there are stacks of records. I can't get to the records. I can't get, I have to get through the records to push up the window so when it pours, it doesn't pour in on the records of which there are too many of. I try not to be a completist. Some people I know want to have everything by a certain artist, want to have everything by a particular label. But I guess at the end of the day, the real question is, how many of these records are you going to listen to? And how many of these records will be, become part of your inner being, your id, as it were? So purging is always a good, good idea. Right now I have like this many records that I've purged. Some of them I bought within two weeks, took it home. That kind of sucks. I bought one record, the uh, Music of Bernard Herman by the New Hollywood Orchestra. Really sleepy. Um, but you never know. Uh, so anyway, that's my question. I'd be curious to know what your comments are. Are you a completist? Do you have to have all these records? Have records taken over your life? Are records causing a problem with your loved ones, with your animals, with your landlord, with yourself? Can you not find clean clothes? Where's the shower? I don't know. There's too many records in my apartment. Anyway. I'd like to know your thoughts on this matter. How many records are too many records?